So I have to apologize again. Seems like a lot of the footage that I had taken during a certain period didn't have audio and I'm slowly working my way through it all. Um, this is one of the last pieces. I think I have another one that doesn't have footage. I've actually just deleted a bunch of it and uh, didn't even show it. But um, <clears throat> what I was doing here was, uh, what you didn't see, is I went ahead and uh, connected the main line to the well and I started that up. I allowed the secondary line to flush out and then I'm putting the um, the ends on them so it, the water doesn't come out from that end. Um, that's pretty much all I have done here. Then I'm going to go ahead and start putting in the tertiary line which is the line that goes from that secondary line all the way over to the trees themselves and that's how the trees actually get their water. So I will uh, cut in and the audio picks back up and uh, I'll let you all see that piece of it. Thank you very much. All right, so I had a little mishap. I guess I don't know my own strength. Didn't think it was that much. Anyway, I dig out a portion of this span between the secondary pipe and the tree um, with, the, with the, the loader. Makes it real easy, digs a nice little trench. And then I take the shovel and I dig just a little bit more. Well, the shovel, I cut the line, so now I get to patch it. Luckily, the guys at the irrigation store gave me plenty of these and I was thinking, why do I even need these? There you go. Now, I'm just gonna pull this line over here so I can get that kink out. It's underground, just a little bit, but I can pull it. Ugh. Here we go. I think I need to pull it a little bit more so it's not kinked at all. There we go. Beautiful, no leaks. And then there's my line. So I leave a little extra because yeah, I'll have to cut it eventually. Something's gonna go wrong. I'll run it over with a lawnmower, something. So just have some extra now. And then I have these drippers. I will hook up. Sorry, I'm trying to hold this. I guess you won't see this part. All right, good. Slowed that stream down quite a bit. All right. There we go. One is done. Actually, I stopped and did another one or two of them over there. So, I have about 300 more to go. How fun. I need to make a tool holder on here. That's not gonna be perfect. All right, I'm gonna get back to work.
looks like new. Digging a trench with this. Then I just go fill it in and repeat and repeat and repeat. All right, catch y'all later. Ah, now for some drone footage. Excuse the wind from earlier. I have a mic cover and it still seems to pick up a lot of the wind. Anyway, so this is the field. If you look on the very far left, you'll see that line doesn't seem to go all the way down. Well, that's the part of the irrigation I have completed already, and I've filled in those trenches. So you can see all of what I have left to do, which is the whole rest of the field. That big trench in the middle is my main line that goes, as I've explained before, halfway, to the, halfway through the field. 
but uh, you know, I take this drone and kind of buzz over the top of that main line just checking for leaks and such it's pretty useful to get up and go look at things without having to drive over there it has some pretty good zoom on it too if I need to look closely at something Yeah, it lets me get a nice overview of it. So right here, you could see I had to go around that tree a little differently, just the way that the, the valve was. I had to kind of go around that tree off to the right of it versus the left of it. But that's the branch, how it tees off. You can see some green on the trees. And the field is pretty barren still, minus a few weeds. It's been a lot of work putting this irrigation in to do this many acres, which was only, I, I can't remember, six, seven, eight acres, something like that. I had 303 trees. That took a long time. It was rough. It'd be nice to have some help on the next set that I have to do. Or maybe I'll just take my time this was all rushed because I got the trees in the ground and then it got hot real fast and I was waiting on them to sketch up the plans for the irrigation so I think the next set I'll try to put in before the trees Here's an overview of the field from the other end. It's right about a thousand feet from where the drone is to the front of the field. And it's about a little over 300 feet wide. Just love the views of this drone. Gives a nice little overview. And of course that field off to the right I'm gonna be cutting and uh, putting some I have to spend fencing to put up and I also uh, need to get some trees in the ground there. But I'll be putting them in the nursery and growing them from seed. I do plan on buying some others, but not 300 again. So there's all my hard work. Yeah, I've done about 15 trees at this point, and I have a whole lot more to go. So I'm going to get back to work. I appreciate y'all watching the video. Please come back for more. There will be more in the future. Thanks a lot.